Hello and welcome back dear friends, it's me Odo. We are back in Pathfinder Kingmaker and we are currently doing a lot of the smaller um Let's finish them quick. Okay. Um should have stopped. Ooh. Okay, yeah, let's just throw it this wool first. This one seems rather easy to be beaten. Cover me. Really? That's just rage and an alpha borg. Borg is much stronger normally. And a dire wolf. Ooh. Fancy. Fancy enemies. Um, okay, you are fighting against the. Okay, um, let's just do this because we are in the middle of the fight and they will get penalty on stuff. Good shot. Okay, um... Oh, we should have taken a five foot step. But the dire wolf is down, so it's okay. And now Miri is down. Okay. Uh, if she stands up, she gets two attacks of opportunity, yeah, but on the other hand, they'll have to do this. This one's down. Okay, let's take a five foot step back. And just kill the Alpha Warg. And this one as well. In them. There is something. Okay. What's more? Work, work. Hey, Ivar. We found him. He's a. Don't come closer. Don't. Okay, stop it. Oh.
Ah, damn it. Okay, uh, five foot step back. And then let's... Ekundayo. Okay, you. No. Um. Stay behind me. Yeah, I'll try. Tristan, let's do a bless on everyone here. Oh, come on, don't attack a Miri. Bad, bad wolf. This wolf is not really done. <laughs> 113 hit points and 119 hit points and another 119 hit points. Okay. <sighs> Bring it. Go away. Can't you attack someone who's in your Range. So Eva is nearly dead. The werewolf's powerful body shrinks and contorts. The beastly features transform into the face of Eva the hunter. There are deep wounds all over his body. So this is how it finally ends. You defeated him. That is enough. Stay your hand. Do not let anger control you. Christian looks at Werewolf's sadness in his eyes. Please, at least speak with him before passing your sentence. Let it be my fa last fairy tale, then. Once upon a time, there lived a stupid young hunter named Ivar. He loved his family, his wife, his son, his little daughter, very much. He also loved making up fairy tales for his children. But one night, he came up with a foolish story, one about a silver dragon that can only be spotted climb to the top of a height as the high moon... moon as the new moon rises. Yeah, we read this already. That very night, the children snuck out of the house and their bodies were found at the base of the cliff the next morning. His poor wife's heart couldn't bear the loss. Lissa, she was gone soon after. So Eva cursed himself, cursed his own blather blabbering tongue and reckless mind. Standing near the graves of his family, he could only mutter to himself over and over, I'm a monster, I'm a monster. Then he felt the self-inflicted curse begin to melt him from the inside, turning him, turning him into a beast. He became a werewolf, swore to protect the village to honor the memory of Lissa and his children. He wanted to serve people, to bring them good instead of evil, at least one. And if you called yourself a pig, you'd have grown a snout. That's exactly why it's so important to always think of yourself in only the best light. <laughs> Anger and pain invited. 
a beast's soul into a human heart? Ha! Huh. When I was a kid, the old crones talked about something like this. I thought it was a fairy tale, though. It is a fairy tale. Why is this lawful evil? I mean, he protected the... I mean, yeah, he protected the village. It's not good. It's not good to protect the village. So, enough, Eva. I've heard what I need. I won't kill you. Why not work for me? Lay down the title of Dragon's Voice and become the Baroness's voice for the people. Were I to spare you, what would you do? So, how exactly is it? People. There's always someone trying to take from the villagers, be it their property or their lives. Many's the villain who's become food for worms in the nearby woods. The only danger I haven't gained much ground against is a gang holed up in the nearby cave. I started hunting them, but it seems I've run out of time to finish the job. Planning a visit, he works. The gang's not big, but they are well trained. They are very familiar with the woods around here. They've made a den in one of the caves to the west near the lake. It isn't far. I stopped looking to the future long ago, but but I don't think. I belong here anymore, especially if people discover the truth. Were you to spare my life, I'd leave. Leave and try to find a new reason to live. Uh, yeah. I think a werewolf would be a good speaker for a lawful evil realm. Sorry, Baroness, but no. I'm not interested in working for anyone else. Besides, the village would never accept me. If they learned who I really am. So please just finish me off or let me go. <sighs> well, then let's finish the hunter. Although we'll have to fight the wolves and the Miri's nearly dead already. Yeah, but on the other hand, if she dies, she dies. It's okay. How cruel. Well, this is what I need. Really? We have to fight him? To kill him? He's back to a hundred percent? Really? Okay, um, let's go. <sighs> uh, let's just do a controlled fireball here. Oh, interesting. This was enough. Oh, nice belt. Nice chainmail armor. Nice sword. <sighs> what does it do? Plus two to dexterity and constitution. Okay, you've got one for strength and constitution. Yeah, it's okay. You also. You've got one for strength, dex, and constitution. 
and you've got one for constitution and you've got one for dexterity yeah okay then i'll take it we also found this chain mail plus two You already have a chainmail plus two. Maximum dexterity two. Yeah, but you've got plus six. Oh no. Um, and what was the last thing? A sword. Ah, I forgot to do these. Long sword plus one. Too good. We can sell it. Okay, we've done this. That's okay. So, okay, we did this, yeah, we can't do this because we already killed him. Because Candlemere, okay, we need to do this. Okay, we did the five times stats. Hassel's reaction was quite unexpected. Would Rani want to learn of this? She might be disappointed. She might even leave our lands forever. Or maybe she'll pay a visit to Hassel and cut off his head. Perhaps it would be better to lie and tell her he was delighted by the letter. <laughs> okay. I think we now also lost the uh, uh, project to find him because we already found him. I hope we we lost it because this would be stupid. Let's go there and enter and just talk to the people. I mean, we did everything in this village, I think. Ah. <sighs> Let's go here. That was the fisherman, I think. Let's see what he has to say. Nothing. Interesting. A werewolf. So that's who the trader cuts himself short and spits. I hope you killed the beast. Yeah. 
he has wares. First of all, we have to. I mean, do we? Will we ever fight with a trident? It's a one-handed weapon. This is interesting. I thought this would be two-handed, so probably it's not so bad. Noble Warhammer. I don't think that we need this one. Hmm, will we... Is there someone in my realm that doesn't have a belt already? Probably. Let's sell this stupid fish. Don't think that we will ever need it again. I and mean, we killed already the Wyvern, so... Um, let's just sell the meat. We, we, we get so much meat and there is more meat. Let's deal. <sighs> Thousand gold pieces, not bad. Each time this two first hand aids lands a hit, the enemy has to pass a reflex saving throw or get blinded for 1d3 rounds. Interesting. Nice aches, but a bit, but a bit expensive. Second execution on that bane. <laughs> Interesting. Okay. You have to say something now? Nope. Mm -mm. So nothing happened here. Let's just go home, or is there some other place in the vicinity that we want to visit? I mean, we could go furthermore. I mean, we could go in this direction and look at more stuff, or look at the Rotten Cave. Why not? Went at the Rotten Cave. Random encounter. Try to avoid. Let's see. And this is a random encounter. Just as we turned toward one home, hold, we ran into a patrol again. We exchanged the usual pleasantries and they offered to accompany us to the city. Uh, yeah, we heard this before. Yeah. Okay. Then let's move up there. We want at these two points. Let's try to avoid it. Mm-hmm. 
time to get some rest, isn't it? Yeah, okay, we will rest soon enough. When we stop. Let's now. Back home, <sighs> the thicker the armor, the longer it takes to ready the corpse for the pyre. That's definitely true about you, Valerie. But you'd be quick. We just sew your arms and legs back, so you're more or less human shaped. Hmm. Uh, I should should stop doing hearty meals. I should do some other. We have so much food. We could afford it. Okay, we are in our. Are we in our kingdom? No. But this is in our kingdom. Hmm, interest. Let's be there. Let's enter the hilltop trail. It has a uh, some special sign, so it must be bigger, probably. I think it's only later on that. It's important for us, not now. Mm -hmm. Please. Quiet footsteps. They're way up. No. Interesting. The way seems clear. And let's move up this point. Ah. Oh. Let's just move move up further. Ah, there is no way. We'll have to go through the tunnels to get up. Careful now. Hmm. We will prevail. Your death awaits. Tear them apart. There is something strange down there. There is not well my cat. Oh come on. Why attack Tristan? Huh? Can you tell me? Uh, why don't you attack the cat? Your corpse. Ah, oh, come on. So, can make a five foot step and do a scorching ray on this stupid cat. 
And don't hit it. Ekondayo kill. I grant you death. Oh, don't hit it. You just have to hit the ten. Ah, thank you. Good. This is interesting. Or at least range. Oh no. This is a portal. Where does it lead us? Will we ever get home again? Hmm. Okay, but we can get out there again, so it's not too bad. Just looks strange. Where are we? We are in the other world. Interesting. So, okay. Let's stop here for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, see you, bye.